Hi there. Uh, okay, today I'm going to tell you how to write and this image into micro SD. And uh, what you need is a card reader, uh, micro SD, of course. The size it depend on you, but mine is 64. You can choose as 32 or it's uh, eight something like that, or 16. It depend on you. So today I'm going to write the uh, open electric image. Uh, into this micro SD. So before that, we have to download a few software, but uh, never mind. I will go through that af after this. Okay, like I told earlier, I have insert my micro SD uh, into this card reader, and finally, I put it into the USB slot of my PC, uh, my my surface actually. Okay, sorry. Enter. Okay, we'll detect uh, any new device. So, okay, new device detected. And then I just go to scan later. Okay, uh, once you insert your micro SD into the PC or laptop, uh, you need to reformat everything. You, you need to make sure the micro SD is clean. So how to do that is you just open any uh, folder and then you check uh, on your drive. So my drive is this one. So you have to verify it uh, by uh, click on format and uh, I format it to file size F eh, file system X fat. Okay, just start. <coughs> So warning over here, blah 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 blah. Okay, click OK. So I have format my micro SD. So the next step that you have to do is uh, once we have format our micro SD, you need to download this Win32 this image, this image whereby we use this software to download add to write our this image into micro SD. So what you need to do right now is. Uh, you have to download this software. You go to Win. Uh, you just type Win32 this image in your in your Google search and then find it. And also, I will include it into this uh, YouTube video in the description part. I will put the link. So what you have to do is you just download everything. You have to download this uh, Win32 this image here, where the size is 12.3 uh, megabyte. Once you have uh, downloaded it, you have to install it. Okay, in my case, I already downloaded it, so I cut the short, cut the time. Okay, you just click on it, uh, click yes, and next, Agree, accept, and uh, I just create a desktop icon. Well, everything is okay, fine. Okay, finish. Okay, we just launch it. Okay, never mind. Click on this. Right, we have win image. Uh, tab, uh, what does it say? The windows over here. Okay, the next step is uh, we need our this image. So for this, I go. I use open elect as this image because actually I want to use this open elect as my media center and install it into my Raspberry Pi 2. So I just go to to open elect media center home to the website actually I download this uh, this image. So you can use a lot of this image. It depends on you what do you want to use actually. But for my case, I want to use Open Elect, so I just go Open Elect, and then I just go to Download, and I go to. Okay, this one is generic build. If you are not using Raspberry Pi, you can uh, download according to your OS. So for my case, I'm using a Raspberry Pi, so I need. Uh, Raspberry Pi 2 actually so that's why I need to go to this one stable 
only like 5.08 um this image so i just download everything the size uh actually the size i already download everything so don't worry okay the size is about 95.7 mb so the next step that you have to do is you extract the content okay i extract here okay this is the uh this image so the next step that you have to do is uh, we write this this image into our micro sd so what you have to do is you just select the appropriate device so just to reconfirm again d is uh, our micro sd where we, whereby we need to write the, this image so everything is correct and then image file we just browse uh, where did I put oh, sorry <clears throat> okay over here I put it uh, into my desktop and then uh, just click on this this image and we open after that we click right so writing to physical device can corrupt the device are you sure yes So wait until it's done. So approximately it takes about less than one minute, uh, depend on your machine device. Okay, right, successful. So uh, we have our this image written into this micro SD. To confirm it, uh, we just open our okay micro SD, and here we go. All written. So you can use this micro SD use uh, with your Raspberry Pi one or two. It's up to you. So that, that's all. Thanks for watching.